So I guess I got approached about uh, five or six, seven years ago now. I think it's about our seventh annual. And the guy who originally started it up with me was basically he was a recovering addict and he was also into the combat sports and he thought this would be just a great way to kind of raise awareness, raise funds and stuff like that. It went from a, an idea to a full-on yearly event that's just grown and grown to a, a formal full-on dinner show. Uh, it's definitely a good experience for people who have never done it to come in and uh, three months of training and see what you kind of got to go through as a boxer. Last year, uh, we lost a loved member of the club, uh, Kaylin Vilness, and uh, so last year we dedicated the show going forward to, to Kaylin. Um, so it's now the Kaylin Vilness Memorial Award, three round heroes fight for community. Kaylin was killed in the Kelowna um, crane accident, so he was doing a very, a very uh, dangerous job. The crane collapsed and uh, he killed five men. He was uh, very ambitious and driven. Whatever he did, whether it was in the boxing ring or in the gym or at work. The honor for Kalen is incredible. It's so beautiful. Each year we're gonna be remembering such a bright light. But Kalen, the main thing was when he came to the gym, and this is more like the backyard thing back in the day, he'd always have this smile, like this really sort of, um, it's like a contagious smile, you know? He was always the person that would make everyone in the room smile or laugh. Especially within the group at the time, like it really sort of like lifted the group up. I think that's the main way that, that I tend to remember him. Like, you know, always like when I came in too, like it would always be very polite, you know, like always like kind of came up to you to like say hi, you know, like I'm here and like, it was just always like a, a nice thing with him, like a very like positive energy. One of the things that he was most proud of outside of the actual fighting, he was so proud of where the proceeds were going and how much was raised and when he fought. That just, it's, it's an honor, honestly, on behalf of my son. We figured a Kalen Cup would be this, this way to commemorate his sort of spirit almost, you know, like his energy of being like a center part of this group and trying to like uplift everyone that was there. Every year we want to have one person within the group that we're training with that we'll pick as the winner of the Kalen Cup. Um, I think it's a really nice way to, to think about him, to commemorate him. I really think the community of Kelowna is real supportive to stuff like this, eh? It just needs to be, have a little light shone on it for them. Given someone a chance, sorry. Right? You give them a yeah. chance to change their life, turn their life around. It's something positive, yeah. right? Yeah. In a exactly. weird way. <laughs> it's a, something that brings community together as well, which I think is important. I'd never been to a boxing match before, so yeah, it was uh, it was it was pretty wild. Well.